Alright, so today I got a new update. As you can see right here, let's go ahead and try to focus into that guy. There we go. Uh, new update's actually a little bit different than normal. Uh, it's version 8.1, 2017.28, and C5, and so forth. Um, so when we also check the release notes, it doesn't seem like there's much changes other than uh, this release contains minor fixes and improvements. So uh, we're assuming that it is going to be the lane change capability that is a little bit better. So I'm going to go ahead and test this out and uh, see how it does. All right, stay tuned. Okay, so here we are entering the freeway. And uh, got a lot of traffic, so we can try to see if we can do any lane changes. And I apologize if there's any smudges or anything like that on the windshield. Just got back from a road trip. Um, so it could be a bit dirty, um, which also um, I do have some video from that trip. Um, I actually went from LA all the way to Vegas on autopilot and back. So I uh, got a lot of uh, nice videos in, uh, on that uh, drive and uh, how well the autopilot did. But yeah, back to this one. So let's go ahead and... Uh, try to test this out in a second. I know the lane's gonna be merging here, so I wanna try to avoid this. Uh, but the biggest problem with the previous uh, software update, actually two of them, was uh, sudden stops from time to time, and also lane changes. I think, uh, the, well, the lane changes themselves, they were just too too fast, right? So um, I was kind of uncomfortable making a change that, that quickly. Um, so I'm assuming that that's what's uh, one of the items that's been updated. As far as the braking's concerned, on my last trip, uh, or my recent trip that I just took, there really wasn't much of an issue. I think the reason that the sudden braking was happening uh, had a lot to do with, um, uh, what's it called, with uh, other cars on, on the sides, right? If they're gonna be making any sort of sudden changes or lane changes because the vehicle was noticing uh, what's happening on the left and on the right. So even if you had no vehicle in front of you, um, your car might do a sudden stop. Okay, so back to this. Let's go ahead and put it on autopilot. So we're gonna go ahead and try to do a lane change in a second here. Let's see how it does. Too much traffic, too many cars on, on the sides, so it's not as easy. Let's go and try it here. Okay, much better. Seems to be uh, way uh, smoother as far as changing the lane. It's not. It doesn't do it really quickly. This might be the update. I mean, this might be the final silky smooth uh, driving that Elon was talking about. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and exit here, and turn it off. But yeah, so that's uh, that's the latest update. Nothing, uh, nothing different as far as features are concerned. So it looks to be more where it is the lane changing capabilities uh, definitely been updated. Um, the car itself is way uh, smoother when making those lane changes. Um, I'm sure there's probably going to be maybe one more uh, update or so coming out before it's final. 
but uh, but this I, I believe is going to be uh, one of the best updates so far. I mean, the autopilot capabilities are way better than they used to be. Um, lane changing is much better now. Um, the braking, sun braking, is uh, somewhat eliminated as well, uh, from what I'm seeing. So, um, other than that, yeah. Stay tuned uh, for more videos. Uh, look for my video for my road trip. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my page. Awesome. Thank you, guys.